let's look at the kettlebell snatch. Kettlebell snatch has its foundations in the basic kettlebell swing. So this is a hip hinge movement, but we end uh, with the kettlebell overhead, and we're doing this with just one arm. The, uh, one of the major complaints I hear about kettlebell snatches is that the, the kettlebell ends up um, smashing into the wrist of people that are doing it. And uh, that has to do with how hard we're gripping the kettlebell. We want to have enough of a grip on the kettlebell that it doesn't fly out of our hands, but we have to allow it to spin in our hands and then time it properly as it gets overhead. So with this swing, it's a hip hinge. The hips come forward, pushing the kettlebell away from us. There's a slight bend in the elbow, and then we finish up over top with the kettlebell behind, behind the wrist. So right about mid-swing here, when the kettlebell is sticking straight out from me, I'm going to loosen my grip just enough so that that kettlebell can start to rotate in my hand. The momentum will flip it over, and then I'm just going to finish in that overhead position with it resting gently on my wrist. 